Hi, welcome to Sam's Tip. If you're an iPhone user, you'll be probably struggling with a storage issue. And you'll be wondering what is a massive other data. Don't worry, I will show you what it is and how to resolve it and get rid of it. Take your iPhone and get ready to see the change. And if you open this iPhone storage setting, you can see that the other data is described as system storage. So to show you what it is clearly, I'm gonna connect my phone to the PC and gonna give access to it by unlocking the phone. So in PC, open up this PC and open the phone storage and right click on the DSMI and click on properties and wait for it to get fully loaded it takes a while and when it totally gets reader you can see it's a massive data and it shows here 30 GB and to show you what it is clearly the folder consists of videos and photos and other metadata. So if I check out in iTunes, the photos shows 16.28 GB and the other data shows us 16.8 GB. So what does that mean? 80 to 90 percentage of your other data is from your photos. And I'm gonna show you how to fix it. So let's start. Step one back it up in your google photos so that you can get access to it anywhere and everywhere with your google account or copy the files into your pc make sure you copy it don't cut paste because it will be an issue for you to delete the meta files from your iphone so copy and paste it and delete it later from your iphone so that you'll get space step two live photos if you are using an iPhone 6s or higher devices, you will be knowing that what is live photo. It is the combination of a 3 second video and a photo. So it consumes like large spaces. So if you have a bulky number of live photos, try to delete it or unwanted live photos or click on share and duplicate it and duplicate it into a still photo so that you will keep the still photo and you can delete the live photo and save too much spaces. With that don't forget to switch off live photos on camera while taking the pic so that you don't have to do it again and again step 3 videos as you know that videos in the iPhone consumes a large amount of space so we can reduce the size using a third-party app here I'm going to use compressor and you'll get the apps link in the description this app help us to compress down the large video file into a smaller file to do that select the video and select the bitrate and make it into lower or you can select the presets from the presets option and select the lower resolution and you can start compressing and it will be saved in a lower data space I hope now you know what is the other data is. So if this video helped you a lot, please give a like and let me know in the comment. And if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.